We're back with another week in our USF Dynasty. Still ranked number one. This week, we got a home game against Houston, who's four and six. As you can see, we're 10-0, and 0, still undefeated. Let's jump into this deep dive, and then we'll go over the recruiting. And we also got to spend that one head coaching upgrade. So the coach has us picked to win the game. Rightfully so, too, because we have Houston beaten everything. But passing offense, which we're more of a rushing team anyway, and turnover differential. Defensively, you know we're number one in the nation. Been that way since week one. And offensively, we're we're starting to get into our groove a little bit now that we have Jordan Smith playing quarterback. Overall wise, pretty much split down the line. They're a little bit better than us defensively. Rating wise, of course, rating wise. But you already know, we about to kick butt. So let's go ahead and spend this coaching upgrade. Then we'll jump right into the recruiting. And for the upgrade, we're gonna max out our kitchen sink, get another 100 points. So now we can spend 700 points on our recruits, which is gonna be big. And we were able to sign Marcus, Michael, and Mike. So that's three more people added to our dream team that we got coming up. Let's see who else we can get in here. We we also have 1400 points to spend which i'm gonna go all out on sean and ira off rip i'm also gonna offer them a scholarship each get that out the way because i am confident that we will be able to sign them and then it's mike and matt which we don't really need either it would just be nice to have them so before i give them points let's see if we can give anybody else some points to sure them up of course i want to give ed the points now we should be able to sign he's coming out to visit us next week aj we're down big on but if we beat UCF, we should be able to sign him. And truth be told, if AJ's a wide receiver, I'm gonna let him go. He's looking like a DB, 6'2", 205. I'm gonna hold on to him. I'm actually gonna give him some extra points. Everyone else I'm pretty good on. And between these two, person I want the most is gonna be Dante. Yeah, I'll take Dante. That's gonna do it for recruiting. See y'all at kickoff. And we're back with the kickoff. Told you tail never fails. They should've went with tails, but we're gonna kick it off. You know we like to play defense first. Don't have this guy rushing and throwing all over us. But he can intentionally ground the ball all he wants. So that's how it's gonna be. He's gonna throw the ball away. All right, I got ya. Oh, Vaughn, I see you get run over. Third down, money down. Get off this field, boys. Ooh, he knew the overthrow. Cause if he didn't, Knox is picking that. Mm. Tackle him. And that's how we started the game on offense. So we're back on defense. Come on, guys. Let's match that pick with a pick. Let's definitely not give him a touchdown. They don't deserve it. Especially doing stuff like that. Why? Why does the game allow you to just throw the ball out of bounds from inside of the pocket? That's on me. I should have been there. I clearly seen him beat him off the line. So we're starting off the game at home down seven. Okay. After that costly pick by us on our last through, we're going to try this toss. It's going to lose us five yards. And yeah, I don't know what's going on with our offense right now. Every time we play subpar teams, we seem to just will always love playing down to the team that we're playing against. So we'll see what happens here. Got to pick up this first. Even though I trust in our defense, we have got to give them some type of a breather. Great catch. There we go. Make up for that, Smith. And then we come out and miss the field goal. Who didn't see that coming? Let me know. Great tackle. Those receiver screens will not work with us playing man. Ideally, they're gonna have to run slants on us all day if they wanna beat our man, but screens is not happening. Okay, this is gonna be the last time I throw the toss with that overhang man. Oh, it worked, okay. So it's not gonna be the last time. That's because they were expecting pass. And we got Smith back, let's go. Huh, let's go. Give my QB back. That's what we're going to do on you all day. And like that, it's a tie ball game. I'm expecting a pick from one of our boys. I'm going to have to watch out for 18, though. Let's see if we can find magic again with this toss. Wow. Third and long. You know we got to go four verts. 
and drop it in there. Oh, wrong guy, but it's still drop. What? Oh boy. If he had more arm strength, that would have fell in there. But that's what happens when arm strength 79. That and I made a bad read. But defensively, we are all over this team. We definitely send them back home with an L. Okay, I'm gonna get a little fancy here. Run this jet sweep. And that'll be the last time I ever run it. How is he shaking you off, Vaughn? Get that sack for me. Vaughn out here leaving sacks on the table. Come on, bro. That needed to be had. Nah, that's not gonna work. Can't do those little quick plays against man. That's when we're the more athletic team. Third and 18, wonder what you're gonna call here. A sack, that's what you're gonna call. There we go, Vaughn, good sack. All right, here we go, second half, let's get it, down three. We need a big half from everybody. Oh, how does he get me by the shoelaces? We almost forgot what our bread and butter was. That's what it is. We are a running team. We're gonna run it down your throat. First, second, and third down. And then we'll catch you off guard and hit you with a big pass play, like now. What I tell you, what I tell you, touch down. I told you, we just have to run the ball and set up the pass. I be getting way too pass heavy. That's my problem. And then they intentionally ground the ball. Third and long, this has to be a pick, but for who? Nobody, that's who. Can we get this first down? No, we cannot. And I had the man too. But my O-line won't give me no time. So we're back to defense. Still got a four-point lead. They need a touchdown to beat us. It's still early. But we have got to make some plays. Let's go. These boys can't run with us. Get them off the field. What I tell you, they cannot run with us. Our team is too nice. It was just a matter of time. Yeah, we gave up 10 points. It is what it is. But we was coming for them. Sit down. Let's get them three and out again. They haven't gotten that one third down conversion against us. And this will not be the first. Oh, God. Can we catch a pick? I need some athletes out there at corner. Two-way players who, who got some hands. Because that should have been a pick that last play. But I'll take this. I'll definitely take this. Third and seven. Can we pick it up with this screen? Uh, I don't know. Nah, we're not going to get it. But we might go for the fourth. Fourth quarter, y'all. Let's go. We are here. This is our time. I told y'all from the jump, this was a special team. And it's doing special things. Like taking sacks. And they going for it on fourth down. That's when you know the game is officially over. Unless they pick it up, go defense. Get to stop, get off the field. Let's go out and party after this game. There goes a the touchdown. They did not get the onside kick. So now all we have to do is just run out the clock. Let's jump right into these stats. Jordan Smith, 12 to 24, 220, three touchdowns. Not bad. Those two interceptions, 
Yeah, I'll give it to him. We always throw two interceptions a game, so it is what it is. Those three sacks, though, we'll get to the offensive line when we get there. Rushing, Joyner did have first 100-yard game in quite some time. Probably since week two or three, so we'll take it. Unfortunately, those three sacks took away dang near all of Smith's rushing yards and has him at minus six. So it is what it is. Receiving-wise, Omarion with a big day. Three for 108. Williams only had one for 11. Ew. Felix McDoom and Dollison had our three touchdown catches. Offensive line. Trash. 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 And trash. The trash. Defensively, freshman cornerback Ben Knox. Less than tackles. Sacks. Sean and Vaughn tied with two. And then Kirby came through with one. And then we had no picks this week. But it is what it is. We still got the win. 21-16. We still in first in the nation. So we'll take that. That's going to do it for this week there should be a video up above playlist up there as well and down below you'll see the subscribe button other than that y'all peace